I'm with that fast life, trying to live slow. I ain't robbing man or trying to flip stones. Welcome to the so there was, show. So there was, there was um, a girl that I was introduced to. And I was starting to work with her. And I went to her flat, right? And I forget her name now. But my friend introduced me, said, you need to link up with her. She's dope, right? Um, anyway, I went and I met her at her flat. And we started writing and whatever, getting along and everything. All good. Went away. Came back. We did this a few times. Yeah? And she was living the other side of London to me. And then one day, um, I, I get a call from... So, w one day I've gone, I gone to her flat. And there's people in the record industry that know that I know her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. A&R people that yeah, have seen yeah, me yeah. with her at shows and stuff. Anyway, one day I go to her flat. There's no answer. So, I called her sister and I said, where is she? She said to me, she goes, she's there. I said, she's not answering. And go, all right, you know, like let me let me come round. I got keys. Went in there. I let her go in first, and all I hear is an almighty scream. Her sister's dead, committed suicide. Yeah. Um, um, that that was an eye opener for me because you know what? A few days later, the A and R guy said we wanted to sign her. Like, you know, basically saying, "Yo, where is she? We're trying to sign her. We want to talk to her, see if she's right. interested." What she had put down on her suicide note was that no one's interested. Oh, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. If it was a week well, later, oh, isn't it? Shit. Do you understand? Oh, like, oh, like oh, I've oh. given, like basically, I've given up my life for this, and yeah. no one's showing any interest. What the fuck is the point? And she was a young girl, but she, you know, and it's always about that last minute of hang on, yeah. just hang yeah. on, yeah. and you know, you can be hanging on for ten years. Do you know what I mean? But it's about that resilience and that inner strength to say, I've got to hang on. Yeah, no, bro, I'm here. I'm here on a podcast. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm fucking I'm all Jaeger or something. Do you know what I mean? Like, we, we, well, obviously, me, Holt, that we used to rap way back in the day, did it over doing our stuff. Yeah, he's been signed Yeah, I was signed and all of that. But um, again, you know, like, that industry, yeah? Like, I was young, didn't know how to navigate it. And there was a lot of other stuff that came with the package of come with me in it. They was like, right, if they're going to manage this guy, like, there's a lot that comes with that, yeah? In the end, made some bad decisions and then that was it for him. Black Wall. Well, was yeah, this exactly. This funky guy. Exactly, but I go Black Wall, I go Black Wall pretty much mm. for different reasons because I was anti-industry. So yeah. I was like, yeah, do this yourself. Yeah. I mean, I, I always say, like, people always say to me, like, hey, you started this. And I'm like, yeah, but it's not always good, bro. And they're like, what do you mean? I go, well, what I did was pretty much told people that were rubbish that as long as you've got money, you can put your records out. Yeah. And then I started hearing <laughs> music getting more and more rubbish. So in some ways, I feel like I'm responsible for that because I actually told some of my friends, bro, you don't need no, no record label. You could do this but did yourself. He, were these guys ended yeah, up being good rappers? No, no, they, they were rubbish. Okay. But I was no, they were rubbish. He lied to his <laughs> friends. <isn't laughs> no, I didn't lie to them. I told them okay. they were rubbish. Oh, yeah, no, nah, he didn't lie to them. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I told them, I said to them, but you've got to be ready. And they weren't ready. <laughs> They weren't ready. They didn't do yeah. it. You know what I mean? Oh, okay. were, and you know when someone's... So how, why do you feel responsible if you didn't lie to them? Wait. Because I told no, them that you could do it. you feel responsible that people started putting music out by themselves? Yeah, that they thought they were going to blow up. Because yeah. not everyone can, obviously. That's how you're, I hear that, I hear that. Yeah. Hear that. That's what it is, you know, but also, like going back to the whole money thing, right? I, I just feel like there's too much emphasis on money and material mm -hmm. things and stuff. And like just, just so people understand, I feel like... I kind of kept myself level-headed with, with, you know, firmly grounded and all that kind of stuff for the simple reason that while everyone else was trying to wear the flashiest clothes, I was buying, like, jackets for £17.99 and wearing them for 11 years. Mm. Do you know what I mean? I and quite often not even washing them because I didn't have the money for the laundry. Yeah, Do you know what I'm saying? Now, what I'm saying is while everyone else is going, sneakers this, sneakers that, Bro, you you'll see me wearing the you know the, the cheapest Reeboks I could get, and back then as well, people used to make fun of Reeboks. Oh, my you know Reeboks I mean? was lit when I was a yeah. youth. Yeah. Yeah. Back in the in the 70s, Reeboks. yeah, early I didn't. 90s. But this is how unfashionable I was. I didn't even know that people were cussing Reeboks and yeah. whatever. And I'm wearing them, <laughs> thinking I'm cool. It's, it's not it's not the the it's the yeah, it's yeah. Not the but but the thing is, but but it's like it's like. You know, it's like one, one thing I, I keep hearing people saying is about, say, for example, when you've got people that go to the gym, they're focusing. Like, I know people like this. Yeah. And I got, I got no concerns about saying, yeah, I rate you for your muscles, but your brain is dead. Yeah. Like you're dumb. Like some of these people are dumb. Not all of them. Don't get me wrong. I'm just saying from the personal couple of people that I know. So all the others might be good, but there are certain people that put so much emphasis on looking the part. 
that they're not doing the part. Oh, you know, the, I call them NPCs. I'm a real believer in the NPCs. Non-playable characters. Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're the journey to make Earth seem real, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Bro, I'm not going to lie, bro. I feel like that even going to work and that. You see yeah. how I force myself to get up and go to work every day? And every day I think, bro, like, why? How have I, how have I got here? Why am I doing this, bro? It's not one of them ones, but I'm you just like doing it. I'm just in, no, I'm just in an automatic... <laughs> Nah, you're good. in the major. Do you know what it is? You have to. Um, you see, if you want to like start, like say, if because obviously with man, man was leaving the roads and like, man working was the better option than what mm-hmm. I was doing but to you... provide for my kids. So for me to get into that mode, it took a lot to come from coming from the jail saying fuck authority, I'm never gonna get a job. Fuck you, I sell crack, I rob, whatever. To then saying, do you know what? I need to get a job now. Someone, <laughs> someone accept me. But, 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 you but look at it. Not look at it. Not look at it this way. Right from a younger, from the second that you got yourself into that job thing, that was the death sentence to your career as a rapper. Yes. Yeah, 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 no, definitely. Yeah. Yes, definitely. So that's how I looked definitely. at it, yeah. and, and that's, that's right. why I, that's definitely. why I yeah, I, yeah, I chose homelessness right. and course, having of nothing. Course, of course, you know because what? But look but what you happened, bro. You've been to my house. No, look course, what happened. Of course, of course. Yeah. But you know what it is? I'll be honest with you. Again, the only reason why I chose the job thing is because I had kids and. I've been to prison for so selling crack. what do you think crack. I had, bro? No, of course, but I've been to prison for selling crack and heroin. And I knew that I didn't want to make money illegally for that for that period of time coming out of jail, having having easy, brand new Yeah, yeah, I get it. Newborn kids. I get it. And I felt like that was my only option. You're yeah, right. Yeah. It wasn't my only option. But at the time, again, I don't have family and friends who, who's got money or anything. I didn't have no savings. So I couldn't even invest in music if I wanted to. Yeah, you know what I'm I mean, look where, where you were, where you do it where you were doing your wrongs. I was doing my wrongs. No, of course. Yeah, of but course. my wrongs wasn't hurting anybody. I don't know if yours was, but as far as I was Sometimes. concerned, it's like, you know, as far as I was concerned, I, I just had to focus on the music side of things. No, no, no. Hey, what is we your did. what is your biggest song or what is your favorite song that you've got out there? What is your favorite? I've, song I've, got, I've, got, I've got a lot of favorites, man. Oh, is it? Yeah, I've got got a, a bunch of favorite ones. Yeah, um, like, I mean, I can one say, of them. Name, name one of them. Um, reflection. Wow, that's good. Yeah. Well, see, back to what you were saying about that. You know, if you if you're a child and you see that, oh, hold that on. getting that money in that way that isn't legal or whatever causes trauma to your family or whatever, and you live through that shit, you want to change that for your own children. Do you know what? I'm and not gonna lie. See, for me, saying. yeah, it's like. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is what I realize is that I don't like. I finished. I did my GCSEs. I did my A levels. Yeah, I could have easily done uni, done all of the JLB thing. But first of all, when I was in school, I had a problem with authority. But as soon as a t- somebody says to me like, duh, 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 I'm I'm ter- I'm locking off. It doesn't matter what you do. There's not a f- there's nothing come you you can do to me that's gonna change me from my mindset you know- now. Yeah. When you did that, yeah. so I, I yeah. always had that problem, yeah. And then when I left school, when I was doing the A levels, and I'm not gonna lie, the stupidity it was, I looked at the gangster guys, and I was just thinking, man, who's getting all the girls? I'm not gonna lie and make it like it was all oh, you know, the struggle. No, that's yeah. like half people saying that are lying, mm. yeah. Some of these guys did not yeah, have to course. struggle, but they but chose you see, it. But see what you said there is uh, the girls, even you mentioned, yeah. like you know what, I, I noticed again from a very early age the things that fuck up people's. Friendships, yeah, relationships, yeah. his money, girls, you know, See, them kind of things. Yeah. So I made it a point not to be materialistic and I made it a point not to be making girls my focus. Yeah. See? And yeah. that's what I'm saying. I, I even said, like I used to say to my friends, I'm that focused on my music that if I'm going from New Cross to Lewisham and I'm walking and you put a girl every two meters butt naked, mm. I'm still going to Lewisham to pay my bills and oh, come back and shit. get on with my work. Yeah, that's you could put a thousand girls on either side of the road. Mm-hmm. You're right? not getting you know distracted what? by that. You know no, what? but that's what I'm but saying. But you know what? I'm not going to lie, though, yeah? At the same time, yeah, the focus... So what I was saying is that was what made me pick the road. And I was like, right, you know what? Yeah, but I then your focus it. was wrong, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was totally wrong. Yeah. I was like, right, but where did that? But where did that wrong focus come from? Because I'll tell you where my focus came from. Mm-hmm. My focus came from being a loner. Yeah, I, I didn't that. have any inspirations or yeah. influences, yeah. people talking in my ear and whatever. I didn't allow that. So you must have allowed some negative no, influences you know to get what, into your ears. Do you know ears? what I know? Do you know what it was? I won't lie to you. I think that there's a few little experiences. It was the fact that I hated the way that the system was. You know, like in terms of like, if you're going to be go to work every day and this person's screaming and shouting. Mm. I was like, no. How come when I go to school, yeah, they're teaching us this, but I had friends 
that were had money and that, and there's people I knew that had paper. And okay, were, I already see your mistake. Yeah, and they were showing me. I that already see your mistake. Yeah, was, yeah, your mistake is you're too busy watching everybody else, not yeah. watching yourself. Oh, no, yeah, that's it. No, you know exactly. Do you know what it was? I was. I'm not gonna. Lie. I know my mistake was. I was lost, bro. I had no focus. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know what I wanted to be. I had so many different options of what I thought I could be. Yeah. That it just ended up turning mm. into. But, but you know it's, it's like you was like rapper. I yeah. was that's it, rapper. Yeah. No, but then uh, when nothing, I did, but then when I'm I did decide rapper, to become a rapper, I was gonna be this, that, this. But that. then when I did decide to rap, it took me differently, innit? Because mm. poetry, like you, you know, said, and that was my art. So mm. I basically was like, right, I'm focused on this rap, innit? And I was when it was rap. I didn't have girlfriends, all of that. I was like, fuck you, lot. I'm doing mm. what we need to do, innit? Yeah. But money was coming on the other side, so it was like, right, do you know what? I've got to do this rap. But, but, but this is what I'm saying. So I personally, me, mm -hmm. I I never let it get to that. I only went and did what I did mm -hmm. when I needed money to make the record. Yeah, that's what my problem yeah? was. And and I and this and this is what I was gonna say earlier. You see, part of the problem mm -hmm. is greed, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course. Greed. Yeah. You want everything. Yeah. You 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 have one cake and you want yeah. ten. Do you know what I mean? Though, but even then, you you, you get yourself greedy. a Ford you know Escort and you want a Lamborghini. I was like, how I was was this is funding it. So my studios and everything was being funded by that, isn't it? Yeah. And then it was always I'm gonna do it until and then I'm and my music bus. But oh, can I 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 just add something to that? Yeah. You were you were doing it because that was funding it. Yeah. Now personally I believe in a lot of situations you get into that cycle where that's always gonna be funding it. Yeah. So what I'm saying is why not do the first one and fund the first record and make sure that your focus is on that first record that it's gonna make the right noise where the record is going to fund your next right. record and your next record and your next record. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's how you break the cycle, isn't it? That's how I did it. I'm sure others have done no, it like that. Do you know that. what? And I hear, when I hear your story, I'm like, right, you know what? I can see how things could have worked out differently. But for me, I'm always, I'm still a believer that that happened for a reason, yeah? And now I can use all of that knowledge that I've gained for the next chapters of whatever's planned. You get what I'm saying? And yeah. But maybe that next chapter, well. and don't forget, that, make, that next chapter is probably not your story, bro. Not that next right. chapter is you guiding the youngers. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Done with that fast life, trying to live slow. I ain't robbing man or trying to flip stones. Welcome to the lit show.